Okay, this is a tutorial on Trick College's um, contest entry, uh, the world's best card trick, I believe. Um, I did this video and I didn't have time to uh, show you how it's done, but today I'm going to show you how it's done. As you can see, I have a full blue back of bicycle cards just there, um, but you can use any deck. Just make sure that you have two decks um, with different colours. Just here, you see? Now, you can lay the cards out and you just find one red card or blue card and you need uh, two decks. So you're going to have the main deck, which in my case is blue, and your other deck, which is red. But you only need one card from that deck. Now, um, you look at this card, it's the five of clubs. So you're just going to find the five of clubs in here. Um, if you haven't seen this video, uh, please go to my channel, um, if you go to videos or uploads, it will be there. And um, watch the performance please before you see the tutorial. But if you know this trick, you go ahead and watch this. Okay, so you find the duplicate card, just there, so now you have two five of clubs. Um, you can shuffle the deck, doesn't matter. The rest of the deck doesn't have to be in order apart from the two clubs. So you've got a blue and a red. You put the blue one in with its deck, so this is now a normal deck, but now you're going to put the red one on the bottom. You can do a Hindu shuffle, as you may have seen in my Dynamo Shoe Trick Part 1, just like that, taking cards from the top and putting them in your hand, like that. They tell you to stop. Now this is a free choice, but the reason you do a Hindu shuffle, um, instead of like asking to pick a card, is because you they might be able to see this card. Um, if you do a fan where you don't show that card like that, that's really good as well. But again, you may need a bit of card sight, and I'll come on to that later with some pinky breaks and double loafs. Don't worry if you don't have very big hands. Um, I know I have a lot of trouble doing pinky breaks because I have big hands, um, small hands. So um, really don't worry, there's no pinky breaks in this trick. So you do a Hindu shuffle, it's a free choice, they tell you to stop, like that. That's their card. You see, the two of clubs. Now you're putting that on the deck. Now you're putting that red card on top. So now you can just do a snap, a magical rub, and then you spread out the cards. Just like that, as you can see. There's a red card there. And I'm um, just going to collect up the deck. Now, uh, very soon, just before Issa, just for my 10 card trip finale, um, I'll be posting a card slight video which will teach you how to do double lifts, pinky breaks and also very cool things to do such as um, spreading out the cards like this, doing flips, um, doing a nice maybe fun fan, um, I'll learn a circle fan soon so I can teach that to you but um, yeah so now you have their red card on top if you don't remember it was in the middle and now their card is here so you want to do a double lift, and the way I do it is that I just riffle through the deck with my thumb and come while you're talking to them, so you're going to have to distract them, and you just come to the top two cards, square them together, and we're just going to bend them a bit like that. And they don't have enough time to just have a look. And if you're bending them, it means that they, they can't really notice. Of course, that is two cards. Um, if you don't think that double lift is very convincing... Uh, please post a comment, it really helps. And um, um, I'd just like to say a really well done to Meggie Moo, um, 169159, um, and also Magician0916. Thank you for liking this video. And um, of course you can do a tutorial, but please mention my name. So, um, you do a double lift. Sorry, that was a triple lift. You do a double lift and you show them that it is their card. They see the card, they're like, wow. Now you say, you, you don't have to say um, to prove that I'm good at magic, because that's why I send the performance. You can say, okay, let's let's do something else. So now you're just setting down the other card. Remember, the five clubs is still on the bottom down here. So now you're just going to use a Hindu force. So you do a Hindu shuffle like this, and then you hold that card up and they don't notice that you're just forcing it very easily. So you just take cards from the top, you're just taking cards from the top, 
showing the bottom, taking cards from the top, showing the bottom. It's always the five of clubs. Okay, so they see the five of clubs, you put it in the deck, you just, you, now you do exactly the same gesture, so a snap and a magical rub, you show, and now you just have to do a bit of acting, so like, and as you can see, one of the cards has revealed itself to us, but of course they don't see that on the cards. Now, um, if you can do a quite a nice quick card flip, I can't do a card flip on this surface because it's very slippery as you can see. But if you can do a quick card flip, that'd be nice as well. But if you do it slowly, they'll notice that the blue five of clubs is in here. Um, and then it all does it for you at the end. Right, I'm just going to run through that again. So, you get two packs, one blue, one red. You get you get um, a normal pack and then you get your substitute pack. You find the duplicate. You put the blue on the bottom, then the red on the bottom. Then you're ready to go. You do a Hindu shuffle, like this. They tell you to stop. That's their card. This is Queen of Spades. You put that on, you put in the red card on top, like that, you do a snap, magical rub. You reveal that there's one red card. You're going to have to do a double lift, so remember, coming very soon before Easter, I'll be doing a card slight video. You just riffle through, and then you, jump, you just catch on to get a double lift. Bend the card like a bit like that, and it looks like one card. I got it. Then, you put, you're putting the other card down very simply. You do another Hindu shuffle. Bearing the evidence, and then this time you show them the bottom card. Sorry, that was a pretty awful Hindu shuffle. I'll just do that again. So, look, there's the card, and there's the other card. So, now I just need to force that card. Um, you can force that card in a different way if you want, but I prefer to do a Hindu shuffle because you did it at the beginning and it seems um, more random. Um, right, so then you force that card, you put that on top, you do a bit of acting. Same gesture, you show that there's nothing there, you reveal that there, well, there is one red card over here, and it is their card. Okay guys, um, just to finish off, I want to recommend some channels to you if you like this vid these videos. Snappy Snappy Magic, Meggy Moo 159, 169, um, Magic 0915, uh, Mr Magic 94, um, Barnaby Howard something. Thing. Um, by by the way, Barnaby Howard, please add a comment, um, then I can see what your channel's called. Um, but um, this is really, I really do recommend those channels if you like magic. Um, okay, so I'll see you next time.